Previously, on Corpse Party Rebuilt. This isn't really a previously on. I just wanted to show you a glitch that I found whenever I was playtesting the game for Memories of Fear, where if instead of going left into the classroom, you immediately turned right, you would be glitched out into the hallway, and if you tried to enter the classroom, you would zone back out into the, uh, the hall. Hello everyone and welcome to my let's play of Corpse Party Rebuilt that was translated by the group Memories of Fear. If you remember last time we played, we had just come back into the school after being told by the good ghost, Girl in Red, that we needed to, uh, we could either leave or come back to save our friends. So Yoshiki decided to come back to try to put the spirit at ease and save everybody in the process. So let's go ahead and get started here. She just gave us a marble statue. Hey, look, it's everybody! Yoshiki, oh, you're alive! Yeah, how about you guys? Oh, Sorry, I'm on my own now. Satoshi, what's up? Got something for you. For me? Oh, oh wait, are you serious? Yeah, anyways, we should split up again, find our remains. Got it. Oh yeah, Yoshiki, I have something to give you. For me? They're shoes! When you wear them, the green ooze no longer harms you. What you mean? The ooze drains humans of their life, but these shoes prevent that. Sweet, thanks! I love that whole little moment right there, because it's like, <laughs> one of our friends and the girl I love is dead now. But at least I got these sick ass sneakers! <laughs> yeah, yeah! Let's go ahead and get to moving. And then they all just completely forget about Ayumi for a minute, too. It's like, oh yeah, our best, one of our good friends that we, we came here with is now dead. What should we do? The, the game, story-wise, and the way it was written, evolved a lot from what it was here to what it becomes in the uh, PSP version. See, why didn't you give me that a second ago? Oh, I forgot to give you this key. Okay, well, turn back now. Go ahead and use it. Yeah, if you don't know what you're doing right there at that area, you'll, you'll get bounced around a lot left and right. I'll go ahead and I'll show that when I go back. So the key also works for this room too. Uh, but what's in here is notes that help flesh out the, the the backstory of the people that were here before a little bit more and the yellow ribbon that I have. But since I already know what to do, I'm not gonna go ahead and read it, I guess, again. Watch if I don't know what I'm doing. See? Now, if you had been reading the notes all the way up to here, they would have told you how to be able to get into the incinerator. It's the rightmost switch, leftmost switch, 
middle switch, second from the right, and then second from the left. Then you come over here, use the yellow ribbon. What will you do with the incinerator? Throw it in? Nope. Hold ha hold your hand out and enter. See, that's a trick, because if you read the memos, it says to hold your hand out with the yellow ribbon. But no. While holding the yellow ribbon, stick your hand in the incinerator. And there we go. Keep going, yes. Turn back! Leave! Go away! I hate everybody. It's so dark and cold. You idiots! Why do you persevere? You kept going, despite my warnings. Yeah, bye-bye! Done. Whenever I hear that song, that sound, the, and then, of the, oh no, you just messed up, it makes me think of a, I don't remember which game show it is, but the, bwah, 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 bwah. I want to say it's The Price is Right, but I could be wrong. I haven't watched any of those game shows ever since I was, like, in elementary school. But now we're done with Satoshi, not Satoshi, we're playing as Satoshi, we're done with Yoshiki for a while. And come down this way. The hallway expanded. Good thing we picked up that iron lever, because otherwise we wouldn't have been able to go through that strawberry jam-covered door. Us take care. A single error may kill someone. And you put the marble statue over here. Head back out this way. <gasps> the hallway extended again! Mm -hmm. Nothing. Everything seems a-okay. What's wrong, Naomi? I have to go check something. Bye. Yeah, maybe it's just her time of the month. Don't worry about it. One, two, one, three, four, five. Open the drawer. Embryo statue. Big brother, this whole time, so I'm not going to embrace Yuka. Heck yeah, you can run for it! Just like that, Naomi's disappeared. Where did she go? 
My money is that she went to Disneyland because she just won the Super Bowl. Make sure you put the marble statue back with the male statue and put the embryo statue with the female. Small golden key is trapped between the floorboards. Acquired small gold key. <laughs> that looks like a piano key. I remember my teacher showing me one in music class. A piano key? Big brother? What's up? Earlier when the walls were closing in and I thought we were gonna be crushed. Then the door slammed shut and we couldn't get out. Who did that? Someone outside had to trap us. You think Naomi did it? No, Naomi saved me back at the toilets. Naomi could never do that to me, even though I've only met her once. And we've only known each other since we've been in this school. Yeah, she'd never do that. She'd never betray us like that. Never! Oh, Yuka, I know we're in danger and this has absolutely nothing to, to do with the situation we're in, but do you like anyone? Huh? What do you mean, like? Don't play dumb, tell me. Because I'm a nosy big brother who's just now pretending like he cares about you. Yeah, that's right. Stand your ground, Yuka. Don't tell that nosy bastard. Huh? <gasps> no, don't tell me. Oh, I thought he was going to say that he loved Ronald McDonald. Okay, because I know that there have seen some Japanese ads on YouTube where that guy is pretty creepy in Japan. Naomi is alive here somewhere. There's no way, absolutely no way she could have died. Yeah. Come on, let's go. Big brother! Fine, don't say anything to me, bastard. See that little blue aura right here? You need the piano key in order to get through it. It sounds nothing like a piano. Uh, yeah, big brother, I'm scared. Are they souls of those who died here? No way, that's awful. Are they guiding us? Walk down the path. I think they're trying to help us. Let's go. me. See? 
Watch that corpse in the top left right there. <laughs> and there's Naomi. And I think this is as good a place as any to go ahead and end this episode. I shall see you guys again next time.